Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Kelly, and if you're a returning subscriber, then welcome back. I'm so happy to see you guys again. For today's video, I am going to be trying a few new lipsticks by MAC Cosmetics. And if you don't know, MAC Cosmetics to me is like the OG of all OGs when it comes to lipstick. So I'm really excited. I've done a MAC lipstick video before. It was more geared towards a holiday-ish collection. So these are just some lipsticks that I picked up um, actually during National Lipstick Day. So shout out to them because I got a lot of these on sale. But yeah, I actually picked up some lip glasses too. So if you want to see the um, lip glosses then stay tuned for a part two video but yeah let's jump right into some mac lipsticks okay so the first shade that i have today is called cream de nude um i just noticed that this is a cream sheen lipstick so i don't really know if i'm gonna like this i can't remember if i like this formula a lot i really like their matte formulas <laughs> so i'm a little bit nervous this is what we're working with. So really cute, classic nude. Um, probably gonna need a lip liner, not sure yet. But yeah, I'm going to try this one out. <clears throat> so yeah, this is, I'm not even going to <laughs> really get into this one like that, but this is the cream sheen formula and just like it says sheen um i'm not i'm not really into that i need it to be like a solid like bold color so this is what we're working with right now <laughs> i wish i had this color in a matte shade or even just a different um not matte shade i wish i had this color in the matte formula or just a different formula in general but that's what i get for not reading because reading is fundamental so i should have clearly seen that it said cream sheen one last thing i want to say about the cream sheen uh, like one of the main reasons why i really don't like it is because i feel like this formula always makes my lips look extremely chapped which is probably weird because i know a lot of people think that matte truly makes people's lips look chapped but I don't feel like that with the matte lipstick so yeah that's another reason why I'm not really feeling this um, I'm gonna give this a 2 out of 10 <laughs> moving on <laughs> well the next shade I'm gonna be trying is called whirl and yes we're back to the matte lipsticks thank you God so this is what whirls looking like I think I'm gonna love it so I'm just going to apply this. You guys, I absolutely love this shade Whirl. I, I don't care what other shades I'm going to be trying today. This one is a 10 out of 10. And I feel like even with like a little gloss topper, it would be so freaking bomb. Obviously, I love it the way it looks right now, but... I don't know it's just like this is one of those perfect nude shades to me and even though it's not um the typical nude shade it's in the nude family so you can tell that this has like cool types of undertones and it's um going more towards the mauveish side but nevertheless i still swear up and down this is a part of the nude family it's super super cute and i cannot wait to wear this because yes since national lipstick day i have not used these lipsticks i've been waiting to film this video and sometimes i don't make time to film so <laughs> I'm glad that I'm finally using this for video so I can just use all my lipsticks. <laughs> the next shade I'm going to be trying on for you guys today is called Photo and it is a brown shade that we're working with right now. Um, I definitely have high expectations for this just because I love brown lipsticks. Y'all, this video is giving fall, okay? Not purposely and I did not buy these lipsticks on national lipstick day with the intentions of a fall lip video but we're giving fall and i love that for me because 
Y'all know this is my favorite season of the year. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna try this lipstick on for you guys. This shade for me embodies like Hershey chocolate. Like I swear when they were mixing this up in the lab, they're like, oh, we're about to make a lipstick that reminds them of Hershey chocolate. And this is gonna be it. And it's gonna be called Photo. They should have named it Kiss. Like literally they should have named this one Kiss, like Hershey's Kiss. That would have been iconic. You know what I mean? Like anyways, but yeah, I am loving this shade too. Um, when I looked at it though, I didn't think that it would look like this on the lips. I don't know why, but I was kind of envisioning, envisioning it to be a little bit more darker, but that's okay. This is perfect the way they made it. And yeah, with that being said, I'm going to try on our next shade. So you guys, this next shade is a shade that I've already owned in my lifetime, but you know, sometimes you have to, you know, make a repurchase of certain shades that you just really like. So this shade is Sin by MAC. And if you don't know about this shade, I'm about to tell you, this is the perfect, like, I really used to wear this shade out back in the day, but now I'm about to wear it out again. This is like one of those perfect burgundy-ish, reddish shade colors, like, mm, I'm about to try it on right now. You see what I mean, you guys? Like, this is one of the OG vampy lip colors. Like, if you look this color up on YouTube, I'm sure some videos will pop up, and you'll see it's used in a lot of, like, grungy, vampy makeup looks. This one right here. MAC did his big one with this one right here. I'm not even playing with you guys. Like, if I was going out or going to a party back in my college days, I was definitely throwing this one on. If you knew me back then, then you know I probably had on a lipstick color like this or I was probably wearing Sin by MAC Cosmetics. <laughs> so we're going into our last shade today and this shade is called Antique Velvet. Um, I don't think I've ever had this shade before. I'm not sure if it's purple or if it's like a burgundy color like the Sin, but let's try it out. I feel like antique velvet is like sin on crack <laughs> like this when it comes to vampy i feel like for sure takes the cake um this is a beautiful color i can't believe i've never had it before or i never purchased it before um i'm slacking clearly i'm slacking because this is not a new shade like i'm pretty sure this shade has been around for a very long time i love it though this chef's kiss 10 out of 10 i'm really feeling it okay so i hope you guys enjoyed these five lipstick shades that i tried on by matte cosmetics today um i personally loved all four shades i did not like that first shade y'all clearly like don't ever i played myself like i really truly played myself when i picked that color i think i just saw that it was like that pretty like really pale nude reading is fundamental that's all i'm gonna say um every other shade that i tried on today was beautiful um i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on those post notifications so that you know when i drop part two of this because i'm going to be trying on some of mac cosmetics lip glosses as well um i think i have about five shades for those two so I am going to be adding an additional part to this video. Make sure you give this one a thumbs up as well. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, you guys.